Hello and welcome to my channel, as promised. Ooh, an unboxing for you. Mm, bit of a big one. You, can, I can feel that there's seems to be another big thing in there. Now I know what it is, obviously, because I've ordered it on YouTube. I tend to watch quite a lot. I'll get there. And uh, I saw this idea. It's art. And I thought, oh, I want to have a go at that, as I would. Something different. Ah, yes, it's packaging and a box. See if we can get him out. Get me out. Nice box. The cat will be sat in that. Here we go. See this? Hmm. What is it? Well, it's it's pouring ink. Uh, no, pouring acrylic. I mean, I have my acrylic tubes, clearly, to do my art with. But this is actually the wet acrylic. So I thought, oh, look good. Watching some of the channels. Brilliant, brilliant. I'll um, name in the box below some of the ladies that are absolutely fabulous. I'm getting into this. And obviously, when I get the hang of it, <laughs> I'll probably do you a how to, my version. Now, clearly, the other ladies, I've seen them and they've been doing it. Years it looks. They've got wonderful studios that have just got a table um, with a, a cover on it. They've got a, a bit that swirls it because you pour your paint on and then you mess with it and what have you. And then you can turn it and whiz it <laughs> and it spreads the paint out. That's the theory. Anyway, they've got the whole studio is just designed for doing that type of art, which is fine. Probably nice just to have one bit of creativity on the go at any one time. Not like me that has about ten on the go. But I just like trying new things. Have a look. I'll open the box. What used to be that? Was it Huey Green? And they used to have like a pyramid of boxes and it's, no, I'll open the box. And it had numbers on it. I tend to think. Obviously an old program. Shows you my age. Oh, goodness. This is full to the brim. What do we have? So in this kit, we have a strainer, which you put in and you put your paints in there and you just let them <laughs> strain out the bottom, clearly. Palette knife for making lines and squiggles. We have straws because... Some of them would blow it with their mouth and then they would get a straw and just blow little bits. Plenty of straws. These, I presume these are like stirrers. You get a wad of pots to be mixing your paints in. Because what you can do is take one pot, so I'm led to believe, put lots in there, stir it up a bit and then pour it over. See where this is going. This is gonna be a messy one. Hmm, what's that? That must be the cloth, tablecloth that you put out, which I shall definitely need. And I've seen the other ladies, and they've got like dungarees on, and there's paint all over them. Oops. What's that one? Oh, that, that could be more cloths. Not sure. More cloths. You get a little booklet. That's handy. You get your roundy bit. Ooh. You get extra glittery bits. Yeah, that's actual glitter itself to obviously sprinkle on top. What else we got? Oh, we got more sticks, stirrer sticks. We've got another palette life. Lazy one, just a shaping one. Good, isn't it? Oh, we got a keychain. You know what you put on a key ring? Okay. We've got a nozzle. I'm sure it'll all become clear eventually. We've got 
some nice canvas. How many do we get? We got one, two, three, four, five. Five canvases to practice on. No doubt. Oh, oh, and then all the paints. Now these are pre-mixed. Let's just take one out. Pouring acrylic colours, uh, premium turquoise. You can hear it. You hear that? <laughs> Liquid. Pouring. <laughs> Loads of them. But tell me how many colours I have in this one. Uh, not on there. As I say, it was a kit. Twen 24 acrylic pouring colours. There you go, show them that then. That's the colours. Silicon something oil. <laughs> I'm going to have fun. But this could be very messy. With me, it probably will be very messy. We've got a little booklet. Shake it, shake it before use. Good advice. It's got the colours that are in there. You've got classic, pastel and neon. And you've got a functional oil. Okay, silicon oil. The key to the formation of cell painting. All oh, right, okay, before and after. I'll have to read all the destructions, won't we? But it's just showing you roughly what you can do with this. And it's like how to mix it and I so it's good. Clearly I'll be bringing you a video on my trials of what I get up to. I do have some bigger um, canvases. I think I've got two. I'm sure I've got two, if not more, of like an A4 canvas. <laughs> but that'll take a lot of ink. We'll try the little babies first until we get the hang of it. Not sure what that's for. Unless you're going to make a keyring or something. I presume the disc is for putting it on and spinning it but it doesn't see can't see anything to put that on anyway <laughs> that's the unboxing another video will be what i get up to and what i can produce <laughs> so many ideas all in one go this poor head how does it cope <laughs> it doesn't you just lay as another thing to do in there I think it'll be a bit like the encaustic art that I was doing because that is like a non-thinking art. You just put your wax on your iron and an eye in the paper and that gives you the patterns. So I do think that the pouring ink and blowing it will be more or less the same. We'll have to wait and see, won't we? I hope you do follow and I hope you do keep up with this one, this little investigation of mine and I just wanted to say a small but very large thank you to all my subscribers we're on uh, 804 now oh it's brilliant brilliant I'll get my thousand yet and it's not monetary it is just for the pure pleasure of me bringing it to you me sharing the gifts and skills <laughs> skills I have in all my creativeness with you. So I'd like to say thank you to all my lovely subscribers. And if you haven't subscribed, I suggest you do. Because <laughs> there's always something new to come. And I just say, give me a thumbs up. Stay tuned to this channel. Anything can happen in the next half hour. You said that. Was it Stingray or was it Thunderbirds? Not sure. I'll let you tell me that one. <laughs> I should say, stay safe, take care. I'm off to experiment. I should say bye-bye for now.